Okay, hi YouTube. Um, I did a video yesterday um, giving you my daily routine of Hydrotherma Natural and after I looked at it I realized the third video when I showed my end results that you really couldn't see the definition of my hair so I thought I'd do a quick video to give you that and to also ask for your opinion on an issue that I'm having with my hair recently. I think I know the answer to it but if I can get some feedback you know I love it. So I hope you can see my hair at least um, more of the definition. I'm going to turn around hopefully you'll see more of the definition of my curls. Um, I was looking at some videos the other today and I realized that I actually may not be a 3C slash 4A. Um, I think I'm like a combination of a lot of different textures and I'm just confused. So, um, but one of the main issues why I'm doing the video is because I'm having issues with my ends. Um, I know with curly hair it's very difficult to kind of gauge when you actually have split ends or not but you know um, I know I clipped my split ends maybe two weeks ago and I did the two strand twist method which was um, I saw that on um, Healthy Hair Journeys channel and that seemed to work but I don't know if you can see like at the ends of my hair like there there are little areas where you know my hair is kind of like frizzy or like straggly and like I don't know if that's actually split ends or that's just the way my texture of my hair is and you know my curls are defined but I just I don't like that like that frizzy looking deal with the end so I don't know if I should be doing a protective style for a while and just kind of leave my hair alone. Um, if you look at, like I said, like my videos from my from yesterday, you know that's basically my daily routine. And I do put heat in my hair, so I'm thinking maybe I need to stop that. And maybe that's is what's affecting kind of like the frizziness. Um, my hair is usually a little bit more defined than this. This morning, um, I washed my hair. And I made the mistake of combing it out because I forgot to bring my comb in the shower with me when I put in the conditioner. So when I got out, um, I had already rinsed out the conditioner, of course. And I put maybe two of the products in my hair and then I started combing. And then obviously once I did my blow drying method, um, it really started looking like a chia pet, like I said in my video yesterday. So... Um, that's kind of like why it looks a little bit probably more bushy than than usual but um yeah but I just if you guys have any tips to give me um one method I was doing when I would blow dry my hair all the little stragglies I was just snipping them and obviously that's not a good idea to do because if I keep doing that I'll be bald so um Give me some tips. Maybe, I, like I said, maybe I should go do some protective styles for a week or so and just kind of leave my hair alone. Um, I do wear my satin bonnet and I do heavily condition my hair when, um, you know, I'm supposed to. But, you know, if you have any tips, let me know. Alright? So, again, here's my hair. And then I really, I realized I didn't get to show you the real length. So, you know, here's the length. and it is growing really nicely like I'm actually getting like a little fro which is cool but you know I don't like the side so then I push it behind my ears <laughs> but um yeah so let me know what ideas you have regarding the kind of frizziness and um but other than that I'm still loving Hydrotherma Naturals I'm standing by it I'm still gonna use it but um I think I just need to lay off the heat alright then Thanks for watching. Bye.